Hi everyone, Amy with Perfectly Posh Homemade, and let's get crafting. Um, so today I'm going to do a cute little shelf sitter. Now I got this one from the Dollar Tree, so this is what it originally looked like. So what I did was I painted the back. And let's do a little tip for you, okay? Um, <laughs> when you're doing this, paint this if you want. I got the uh, Ultra Fine Glitter Paint. Um, it's supposed to be pink, but I didn't paint this white first, so it doesn't look pink. It kind of looks purplish, which is cool. I'm good with that, but, um, <clears throat> so that's a tip for you today. So I'm going to do, so let's kiss a little Valentine's mini. These are, um, Magnolia Design Company, uh, stencils. So they're silk screen, um, and mesh and reusable. So I'm going to use these and the little... Um, kiss. Um, so when you're using the Magnolia Design Co. Uh, stencils, you um, want to make sure that you fuzz them. They call it fuzzing them. So what you're going to do is they're very sticky. So you're just going to use it on a little towel or this is the fuzzing mat from Magnolia Design Company, which is amazing. Um, if you're going to do stencils, I would suggest getting it for sure. Um, I love these stencils because I don't have to worry uh, too much about it bleeding under because they're, they're so screen and they're sticky. So I've done that like two or three times. And then I'm just going to place it where I want it. On here. And then you just smooth it down. To get all the bubbles out. I don't want any bubbles yet. And I think I'm going to do the lips at the same time. Now I've, re I've used this one before as you can tell because um, I, I like to fold down one side so that it's easier for me to get it up if I need to. So I don't need to um, do this one uh, as many times for fuzzing. So I think I'm going to put it like that. Um, another thing is when you do like a glitter or something, if it's not a smooth surface, you might want to um, like use a sealant on top um, just to make sure. I did not, so hopefully this turns out good. If not, I'll just paint it over and redo it. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. And I think I'm going to do the Let's Kiss in black, and I'm going to do the lips in the raspberry chalk paste. So let's see what we got. Do the black. Um, I, you don't need very much at all and you want to just lightly go over it. So you don't want to press too hard. Um, it's just literally like buttering toast. You just go lightly over it and take off any excess that you have that's on there. So what's everybody up to today? If you're watching this on a live, say hi to me so I know that you're watching it live. If you're watching a replay, please say that you're watching it on a replay just so that I can keep track of who's watching. All right, and then we're going to do the other one in the raspberry. Raspberry lips, right? I'm hoping it shows up good. I'm not great at picking colors. All right, just lightly go over it. Take off any extra that you have on there. So it should look like that. Okay, and then you're just gonna peel it. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. What do you think? Let me know what you think. Okay, I'm gonna put this over here. And then let's peel this one off. Let's see if you can see it as I do it. And that looks really cool. I think those colors are really nice. So when you're done with your stencils, you want to rinse them in cool water quickly uh, because you don't want the chalk paste to dry in the stencil um, because it can clog the stencil. 
but I just wanted to show you real quick. This is what I'm thinking I'm going to do. Um, I got these from the Dollar Tree too. So if you can see that, I think that'll be really cool, right? And then I made a tiered tray from the Dollar Store. So let me grab that real quick. So I made this tiered tray um, so I can put all of my Valentine's stuff on this and I can switch it up for all the seasons. Huh? So this is all Dollar Store. So this is a Dollar Store plate. This is a Dollar Store candle holder. And this is a Dollar Store cake pan. I couldn't find a pie pan. I was going to do three tiers, but I couldn't find a pie pan. But you can always add to it, right? So if I go next time I find a pie pan, I can always add another layer to it. So that's kind of cool. And I just used um, a white uh, Waverly chalk um, paint to do it. Um, I think it turned out really nice. And I think this is going to look adorable on it. Um, so... I am going to put the link to the Valentine minis um, in the description above, um, and I will put a link to the chalk paste. Um, this paint is just from Walmart, um, and it is, let's see what color it is, um, ultra fine glitter paint, and it's celebration pink. So that's the other thing I used, and the surface was from Dollar Tree. Um, but I will put all that in the description too, so that you don't have to go looking for it. Um, let me know how your day is going, what you got planned for the rest of the week. Um, and if you haven't, um, please feel free to sprinkle, sprinkle my page and, um, this live. And, um, if you haven't joined my VIP group, that would be awesome. I would love to see you all in there. Um, and I hope you all are having a great day. And I will talk to you guys later. Thank you. Bye.